Today's video is on the most important theorem and this is repeatedly asked a question from graph theory. See here that statement states that prove that a tree with n vertices has n minus 1 edges. So what are these vertices and what are these edges? And see this is a vertex dot. So this is nothing but the point is nothing but the vertex. And what is the edge here? So if you have two vertices this is v1 and v2 and if you connect these two vertices and this is nothing but the edge so this is nothing but the vertex so got it so clear so point is nothing but the vertex and the connecting line between any two vertices is nothing but the edge so in this what we have to prove we have to prove that a tree with n vertices so if you have n vertices and that tree has n minus 1 edges. If you have 3 vertices here, then you will be having 3 minus 1, 2 edges. So, these are the edges. Lines are nothing but the edges and the dot is nothing but point is nothing but the vertex. So, if you have 3 dots, so you will be having 2 lines, 2 edges. So, this is what it is asked to prove that in the theorem. And see here, the proof is going to be, so we prove this theorem by mathematical induction. As you know that according to the mathematical induction, we have to start with n is equal to 1. So, what is this n? So, n vertices. So, if n is equal to 1, so if I take 1 vertex, so this is v1 vertex. So, with 1 vertex, we have no edges here. So, we can't draw a line. So, there are no edges here. And see, if n is equal to 2, if I take two vertices, that is v1 and v2, so I can connect these two with an edge or a line. So, I have only one edge here. So, if I take two vertices, so I can make one edge. And see, if n is equal to 3 here, so if I take three vertices, that is this is v1 and this is v2 and this is v3. So, if I have three vertices, so how many edges are there? So, I can connect these two with one edge and these two with one edge. So, total they are one, two, two edges here. And see, if you observe carefully, if I ha have n vertices, so this tree has n minus one edges. So, if n is equal to one, if I take one vertex, then I have 1 minus 1, 0 edges, no edges. So, if n is equal to 2, so here n is equal to 2. So, 2 minus 1, so 1 edge I have. If n is equal to 3, see here, this is 3 minus 1, 2 edges I have. And similarly, if I keep on taking n is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on, so I will be getting n minus 1 edges. So, by mathematical induction, this theorem holds for all the trees with n vertices. So, if I take n vertices, I will be getting n minus 1 edges. So, this is true for all positive integers and therefore, according to our statement, a tree with n vertices has n minus 1 edges. So, this is how we have to prove through mathematical induction. So, we have to take n is equal to 1, 2, 3 and so on and we have to state that it is true for all positive integers and so according to the mathematical induction, we say that the theorem proof is uh, holds on according to the mathematical induction that a tree with n vertices has n minus 1 edges. So, this is the proof which you have to write in the examination if it's asked. And this is the most important theorem repeatedly asked uh, question here from the graph theory. Thank you so much for watching. If you really like, you know, please practice, pass it on to your friends and take time to raise your thumb and do follow this channel. Thank you so much.